Okay, gang, it's been a while since I did the separating first and last names out of one column, so uh, bear with me if I don't get it exactly right the first time. But essentially what you want to do is you want to make room over here to the right for new columns because when these separate, it's going to start pushing data over to the right. So what I do is I uh, right-click and I insert uh, columns. I told you it's been a while since I did it. So I insert columns to the right. Click on the right to the top, I insert another column, and I, just to be safe, uh, that should be funny. The reason I did two is because now I'm going to change this to first name, and then last name. Then I just leave this one blank, and I might call it delete later. Uh, the reason being is because if there's only one space, it'll push the last name right over into here, but if there's a middle initial, it puts that middle initial here, shoves the last name over here, and I have to manually go bring it back here when I'm done. So uh, what you do is you highlight the column, and you go up to, I believe it's data, text to columns. Pull this up so you can see it. And then you want it delimited. And then you click Next, and you want it by space. So every time it sees a space, it pushes something over to the right. And you can see that it's doing here, and it's going to cause the problem that I know it's going to cause. There's nothing we can do about that. And that's pretty much it. Just go to Finish, because there's nothing else you want to do. And it says, do you want to replace the contents of the destination cell? So if we hadn't made these new columns, it would have replaced title. But we made new columns to allow for that. Click OK. So now all I have to do is go in and highlight all this, select all, and then control X, click here, control V, and then I have to go through and clean up the entire column. Then when I'm done, I go through and I delete out this column, and everything moves back over, and then that's it. Uh, it looks like i got to put last name in here, too, for the Cyrano import. So that's how you do uh, text to columns, and that's how you clean up uh, the database for our clients.